Hey there, hey there. I'm just doing it uh, vertical. It's just easier. <laughs> I don't care how it looks on YouTube. I think people that will listen and tap, they get the point. So today is January 17th, and we're reading out of 365 days, and I titled this Arguing with Yoda, and you'll see why. So do or don't do, there is no try. Yoda. And then John Wayne quote, trying doesn't get it done from the movie The Cowboys. What if Yoda and John Wayne are wrong? What if trying does do it? I may have tried and failed many things if I see it from the vantage point of the world I live in. What if every time I try, I'm actually a step closer to the thing I'm trying for? My inner child would sure could sure use some loving kindness because this part of me can get very triggered when he or she hears trying is basically a waste of time. What if trying does do it? I'll keep trying because I don't want to give up on myself. I may appear to fail often, but what is what but what but this is a wonderful thing. The ability to keep trying can get me to a place where I realize I'm just pushing the ego's agenda. When I wake up to this, I can see that I'm not alone. If I tune into the great spirit or whatever I prefer to call it, I can turn any challenge over to this power greater than myself. When I do this, I actually open up to greater possibilities. Things now have a way to unfold with a lot more ease. So trying can do it eventually. Thought for the day, and it's missing. <laughs> I think this is an old book. Um, so yeah, I've heard that and that always kind of troubled me or bothered me in the past, this idea of trying doesn't get it done or do or don't do, there is no try. There is trying, especially in a body as a human being. To let you know we're not ascended masters yet or we would not be in bodies here on the planet. So it's that idea of no trying does get us a step closer and the the other, the most important thing here to me is trying and failing and trying and failing and trying and failing. All of a sudden, you might wake up to like, wow, I really am pushing an ego-based agenda. And what if there's something so much greater that's intended here? And what if that can make a big difference? So, karate chop. Even though I hear it all the time. Don't try, do. Trying doesn't get it done. What if trying is exactly the thing that does get it done? One way or another, I choose to honor my truth right now. Even though I try and fail, sometimes I get stuck in a cycle of trying and failing. But what if that's a necessary step that actually wakes me up to something truly divine? Go to the eyebrow, what if trying does get it done? One way or another, it does. I try and fail and try and fail, but eventually I wake up. Maybe I'm pushing an ego-based agenda that's not for my highest good. Maybe I'm meant to wake up to something greater. And the frustration, the defeat that I experience from trying and failing is the very thing that awakens me to a better way, to another way to something so much good, so much better,
that brings more goodness into my life. That's not me pushing some agenda. That's not for my highest good. And what if all that pushing helps me let go over time? So I can let the great spirit take the lead in my life and truly be used for the highest good. Take a breath, a little fu funny thing there. <laughs> Sometimes we, when I, when I tap, it's like, oh, well, that was interesting. So um, I hope you found that helpful. And if you did, go back and tap on this as many times as you need to. And we're definitely in the home stretch. And see you back here tomorrow for day 18. Bye for now.